Hello my friend and welcome to part number 29 in this uh, playlist so in this video we are going to be testing our uh, send or uh, share a message feature and see if it is working or not and also I'm going to be answering a couple of questions that I have got from you in the comments for uh, previous videos of course so without any further ado let's get into it but don't forget please to go right now and subscribe to this channel and also turn on the bell icon so if i post something new about app development you'll be the first one to be notified so don't forget to join this community and right after that let's go so uh let's actually test the the app so uh maybe uh let's just uh, pick up uh, something here so let's first uh, share this message so long press on that then i can send it to jack and mark at the same time so if i click it on send message and if i check it the my conversations i will see it here it was recent as you see and also here it was sent congratulations so this worked and let's actually uh uh, share this image uh, sorry this message just to show you an error that I have made so we can share it with both of them send the message you can come here and see see the last message is not this one even though I have just showed you that I have sent this message this needs to be seen here the reason why is that since uh, so I will show just uh, the uh, the problem that I have uh, made so I can come here and go down to this one just to, uh, just like so I can show you my pro so create document the problem though is that is w with this one so for the timestamp that of that message is gonna be the timestamp of uh, this message so if you sent it at, uh, at 11 a.m. for example if you resend it again, it will still at 11 a.m. That's why it appears on the top, not on the bottom. So if instead I can come here, so if you just shared it at at the in the moment, then uh, the timestamp should be the current time. That's uh, that's the only mistake I have made. So just do this and everything will be okay. And uh, I think that uh, so I have tried it. Uh, the test was easy it was good uh, and the problem here is that the last message does do not appear uh, here so for whenever we share a message we need to update the last message of that chat so the last thing I have shared was a text and now uh, I still have an image so we need to fix that and also uh, add something so this is this was just a quick test it is working fine uh, just follow my steps and you will have exactly what I have here and now let's actually move on to the next step where we can fix just the, uh, all the errors so you can get uh, the full picture so for the errors that uh, we need to, uh, to fix as I told you before so the first one of the timestamp it was fixed but once we have created something a new message in the chat so this is a new message it needs to become the last message so just if you have forgotten I, I can remind you uh, so for so we have a chat its chat has the last message message timestamp image audio type so on and so forth and uh, this one here so for each chat we had these four uh, these five fields that we use to show what is the last message and when it was sent so we need to do that right now so I think uh, so let's do that it was it is very easy so I can come here right after we have created the message we can then so by the way we will create a new message so uh, the first thing is to get the output and add it to the last message so this is the obvious way so let's just uh, uh, use it so let's so sorry if my voice was not uh, good enough I'm a bit sick so here we can uh, come after that we can now here we can update that last that last uh, no the chat we need to update the last message f uh, five fields so we can update document and we want to update uh, 
so we don't we cannot we do not know the charge yes sorry the charge is so as we did the, in the previous episode the charge reference is the first one in the list the same goes here so we, we are talking about the first charge we send the message there then we update the last message in that particular charge so since we have done this for the first item in the list in this page stage we can do the same here because we cannot send a message in charge a and update the last message in charge b that's gonna be a total mess so item it index the index will be uh the first one of course confirm and then we can just add five okay let's just add them all and then pick up those that we need so uh so yes so the last message it is the text so what yes it is the text so i will just use from do it from a variable and i can use that output that i have just done uh you know in a minute so this message text uh for the message timestamp it is uh it can be uh, uh the current time or pick it up from this output so let's just keep all from output but the output is going to be the timestamp because they have just changed that to current time then this will be equal to current time image uh so the image even though there is no image we will use that and we will keep it empty and we have already discussed that in the in the in the past episodes so it's not this one to message image and uh, the audio again we can just go to the action output go to audio and pick it up and last but not least we can come uh, to the type and here so we can pick this one up and say the type that's fine that's good so this one this is this was the first thing that we needed uh, to fix and uh, this the, the 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 next thing that we need to fix is gonna be here so we just want to have the time step of that message right down here so uh for so i will come so for this, this is the column and just below every below this uh, the container all of this so below all of these so for the user so we'll below all of this i want to just add a small text uh where so this is messy so i need to drag this this and i can just uh, clean everything up so i can see only what i am working on so clean it all right so why can i need to open this up all right so everything now is clean so for this one so it should appear on the other side so yes and then this should just show us uh, the time step of that particular message and i so we want to choose date format and then we can uh, use uh, this one or this one so which one you like so i will pick up this one maybe the other one is convenient so and we can just copy that paste it for the other side which is the authentication user so let's just clean that up and then put it here so the same so there is nothing to configure so i think that this is everything we need to fix so uh, hopefully this feature was actually or not hopefully but thankfully this feature was working as we expected now i will just move on to the next step where we we'll just answer one question i only have found one question to answer and uh, that's weird because i'm all on all the time open for your questions so go right right now put any question that you have in the comment section so i can make a video answering your question why are why are you shy make sure you put all your questions in the comment section below so we can uh, learn together there is no way to be too to shy away from me or anyone here we are we are all here to help each other so uh, let's actually move on to the q a session so for the last question it was from this uh, 
sorry, uh, this guy here. And the question was, if it is possible to allow someone to go live. So when you talk about uh, going live, so uh, personally, I don't think I can apply it because I will just show you why. So here you can see that we have, we still have the status feature, some other stuff like notification page, which was asked a lot by one of my uh, viewers here in the channel. So I, I took it up. It was here, but I took it up. And anyway, you see here that we still have the group feature. I think that if we keep uh, going, we can reach 100 uh, episodes. But I would try my best to see. But I will just give you so for the, the one who asked who asked this question, you can just go and uh, learn more about uh, this. Uh, uh where it is so the mox yes here it is the mox live stream you can learn more about this feature or plugin if you can if you want to call it like that you can learn more about it that's how you do live streams uh directly from from a flood flow or you can use another another api that's another topic and by the way by on the, talking about apis uh just after i have finished this one i'm gonna be uh, dedicating all of my videos to just apis ais and build chip we can learn more about that so we can make ai apps we can use ai to bring more value to many fields so different different fields of course so they just keep that in mind and if you want to learn more about ai and apis and more uh, fun and advanced uh, app development uh, topics make sure you subscribe right now go right now and subscribe to this channel don't f don't forget to turn on the bell icon so whenever i post something new you'll be the first one to be notified so let's just go on with the question and he g and he wanted to someone for example if i reply to a certain comment he wanted to translate that in like uh, in english so if they wrote if they wrote that in arabic you want to translate that in english so you could just uh you know that's a bit complicated because you need just an api or you can use a function you give it the, the text in arabic it translates that in english and create that message there it's uh, totally it's totally different but it's a worth it's worth trying maybe i will keep i put this in uh the playlist of course that's i like the translation stuff but i'm not sure i uh, uh i'm not sure i can make the live stream because it's going to be uh, more complicated and you take much across so much time and i don't think it's worth it right so i will just do uh as i told you uh, the translation i will take a look at that if i have time and if i say that it is going to be useful for you for all of us so i will do it of course why not so uh, thank you so much for watching i hope that you have uh, uh, liked this video so today is friday and i really hope that you will have a very very wonderful weekend uh, and uh, make sure you are subscribed to this channel so you will not miss any of my upcoming uh, videos and uh, until next time thank you so much for watching and see you on the next video